Kevin Kevin got here. With my return to YouTube. So I am done with the LSD. It died in week five. So yeah. But I'm in a new league called the PBA. So I just wanna get straight into my match. Like to the team. I took over for a team that was one, two, minus four. So yeah. Alright. So my so the first Pokemon team is Mega Mawile. Mega Mawile is honestly my favorite mega evolution to use and that's just because it hits so hard this thing basically has a base 210 attack which is scary trust me so this thing gets player off it gets iron head it gets coverage moves at, like ice punch thunder punch fire fang knockoff um sucker punch so yeah, I mean it's lacking in HP and speed, but I don't really. This thing is meant to break walls. It isn't. It's meant to do get in like it's meant to switch in on something it, it knows it can beat, and beat it. So yeah, all right. My next pick was Clefable. I've used Clefable before, and it's nothing to be scared. It's, it's, it is, like, there's a reason it's so good. It's because of Magic Guard and Unaware. Well, and it's coverage, but that's for offense. I'm talking about defensive. Like, this thing is so bulky with, with Magic Guard. Basically, which basically doesn't let it get status, by like it doesn't get hurt by po any poison or burn. So yeah, this thing and like, I mean, this thing can be used offensive with a like with with unaware to avoid. Call mine sweepers like Lottie, like the Lotties, even though I have a Lottie, but we're not going into that. So, yeah, this thing is a force to be wrecked. Like, this thing is such. Oh, it's so bulky. So, my next pick was Lottios. Lottios has base 110 special attack, base 130. Special defense and base one ten speed. It is nothing. <laughs> like it's, it's just honestly, it's honestly really good. I mean, I don't think it's good as Latios, but I like Latios, so don't judge me. It gets a lot of coverage moves like Energy Ball, Surf, Thunderbolt, Ice Beam. I don't remember what else it gets, but I know it gets more stuff. It gets Psyshock, Psychic, and Dragon Pulse, and Draco Meteor. And if you pair that with the Soldu, which boosts the dra Psychic and Dragon type moves of the Lotties, then you're just kidding really hard. So, yeah. Alright. With my next. My next one is Rotom Wash, the washing machine. So, Rotom Wash, I mainly use as a dual screen setter utility because it gets a lot of great utility moves. Like, it gets Will O Wisp, it gets Defog, like I said, it gets dual screens. Um, I forget what else it gets, what other utility it gets, but. It get it it can be offensive too with hydro pump, thunderbolt, volt switch, shadow ball, uh, dark pulse. So yeah, this thing is this thing is nothing to be. This is not to be taken lightly. You hear me? 
So yeah, with that out of the way, my next pick was sorry about that. My next pick was Terrakion. Now Terrakion, it's like a. All right, I'm back. Sorry about that. Um, where was I? Oh yeah, Terrakion. Terrakion is honestly my favorite garden of uh, f justice. Legendary, whatever you call it, it is in the game. It gets moves like Stone Edge, Earthquake, Close Combat. I believe it gets Iron Head, Poison Jab. Um, uh, what else? Uh, I don't know if it gets Knock Off. But yeah, it hits really hard. Because, like, Banded? This thing is a massive wall breaker so yeah the next pick i don't know much about but i picked i got toxic croak i dropped uh i dropped decidueye for it because i already have three grass type i had three grass types and it was the most useless out of them so yeah Toxicroak gets moves like Drain Punch, Poison Jab, Ice Punch. Uh, I think it gets Earthquake. Uh, I know it gets the ability Dry Skin, which basically makes it immune to water but weak to fire. So, yeah. This thing gets hard. Uh, it has base 85 speed, I believe. Yeah, base 85 speed, and it just, <sighs> this thing, th I'm pretty sure this thing will come in handy a lot, because it's poison fighting type, so it deals with, like, steel fairy, uh, deals with rock, grass, so yeah, it can't really, it's quite weak to... Psychic, but it outspeeds a lot of it can outspeed a lot of psychic types, well, the bulky ones, anyways. So yeah. All right, next was Mamoswine. Mamoswine, honestly, is my favorite po is one of my favorite Pokemon in general, just because it represents the mountains. So yeah, <laughs> this thing's offensive typing is great ground and ice has almost n paired has almost n no resistances between it. only water and bug types resist both of its stabs which is araquanade um funny enough it gives uh Surskit something over masquerade so yeah so, uh base 130 attack Tied for the highest on tied for the second highest on the team, not including abilities. So yeah, earthquake, ice shard, uh, ice crash gets knock off. Um, what else does it get? I think it gets poison jab. But I'm not completely sure about that. It gets rock slide and stone edge. Edge. So edge quake is always something. To be reckoned with. So yeah, all right. On the next Pokemon is Volcarona. Volcarona is a scary special attacker. It's quad weak to rocks, but if it gets a Quaver Dance up, it just wins. Especially with its signature move, Fiery Dance, which basically lets it uh, it basically. Half the time gives it a special attack boost. So yeah. Fire and it's and it never misses unless you uh have accuracy dropped. So yeah. It's good Pokemon. Alright, sorry about that. I had to let my dog out of my room. But yeah. Volcarona with Giga Drain, Bug Buzz, and Fiery Dance and Quiver Dance is nothing to be is nothing 
to, uh, dang, I forgot what it was. It's nothing to underestimate. Like, this thing gets hurricane too, so it can function in rain teams. Quiver dance, bug buzz, gauge rain, hurricane with rain, just goodbye. <laughs> so, yeah. Alright, on to the next Pokemon, Tapu Bulu. Tapu Bulu also has base 130 attack, just like Mammoth Swine. But it, and it gets Wood Hammer, which basically makes it a nuke. Like, Banded Wood Hammer from Tapu Bulu just rip you. R.I.P. your chances. I mean, it's... It's defenses aren't even that bad either. Base 115 defense, base 95 special defense. I mean, its lowest stat is its HP and its speed. But that's something for another day. It gets, it gets Mega Horn, gets Zen Headbutt, gets Stone Edge, Super Power. It gets a lot. So, yeah. Alright, next is Kartana. So, Kartana, as you can see, has base 181 attack stat, and a base 131 defense, not to mention the, the base 109 speed. You should be afraid. I don't know how, how Prison Iron Place got this this late, but, it, but he did. I don't know how. And it was one of his last picks, too. Because he was last in the draft order. But I'm getting off topic. This this thing has some pretty good coverage. It gets like it gets things like Leaf Blake, Smart Strike, it's Sacred Sword. It what else? It gets knockoff, I think. Night Slash, Psycho Cut. Um Yeah, it gets it gets X scissor. Which could come in handy. So yeah, this thing is pretty good if you, I say so. All right, my last Pokemon was a Pokemon I dropped. Well, it was a Pokemon I dropped something for. I dropped Honchkrow for Sharpedo. So Sharpedo, look at those defenses. Base seventy HP. Base 40 in both defenses. It's a glass cannon. It has base 120 attack. And base 195 speed. Or special attack. And, well, base 95 special attack. And base 95 speed. Which. And it gets speed boost, which raises its speed every turn. Basically making it the fastest thing in the game if you play it right. One of the fastest things. Second fast behind... Well, third fast behind, Me behind Mega Blaziken and Ninja Ask, but... I'm getting off topic again. So, this thing... It gets things like... Like, Protect, Waterfall, Ice Fang, and Crunch. Goodbye. Just goodbye. You're dead. Let it get the speed boost. You're dead. That's... That's all it has to do. Get the speed boost, and it can sweep. So yeah, the only well, the only thing you could do is prankster tailwind. Wait, no, you can't even do that because it's a dark type. Ha! No prankster, no prankster tailwind. But wait, no prankster tailwind still works. No prankster thunder wave for you. But yeah, that's my team. My Z users are. Um, Volcarona is a normal user, and Cartana is a super Z user. So, yeah. Alright, that's my team. Make sure to like and subscribe. Leave a comment saying what your favorite Pokemon to use in Draft League format is if you do Draft Leagues. And, yeah. So, with that, I'll see you next time.